In the Ukrainian conflict zone, Russian T-90M tanks have been supplied with cutting-edge high-explosive fragmentation shells designed for the elimination of Ukrainian infantry, Top War.ru reports. These advanced munitions, known as Telnik, belong to the category of shrapnel fragmentation or beam fragmentation ammunition. Upon detonation in mid-air, they disperse preformed submunitions over the target area, effectively neutralizing enemy personnel. The multifunctional 3VOF-128 Telnik projectile is, so far, exclusively supplied to T-90M Prorov tanks in Ukraine, as its deployment necessitates specialized equipment. This comprehensive system comprises a tank ballistic computer meticulously tailored to the unique characteristics and ballistics of the new ammunition, an interface for inputting data into the projectile itself, a docking mechanism, and the 125mm 3VOF-128 shell featuring a fragmentation-type warhead designed to explode above its target. In early 2019, the new projectile was known to have a number of possibilities for options for hitting the target, a gap on approaching the target, a gap directly above the target with its defeat by flying in the form of a cone-shaped body, also several variants of ground-based shock breaks action. Upon detonation, this munition releases 5.4 kilograms of fragments, blanketing the target area in a cone-shaped pattern. Because of the ability to hit a target with a directional beam, cone, of shrapnel fragments, the projectile was already often called fragment beam. An explosion on the trajectory over the target and on approaching the target had become one of the requirements for the developers of ammunition, for the effective defeat of enemy manpower, which is in a certain kind of shelter. In Ukraine, the Telnik projectile has demonstrated a remarkable six to eight times greater effectiveness against enemy infantry compared to the standard three of 26 high explosive fragmentation round. Despite its enhanced capabilities, the Telnik projectile maintains the physical dimensions and weight closely resembling that of a conventional ZOF-26 high-explosive fragmentation tank round. 